Hey guys, Crazy here, bringing you back episode 2 of my Clash of Clans Clan War recaps videos. Today, we face the Codfathers in a thrilling clan war which is very close throughout the war, but we edged out a 3 star victory. And as you guys can see, we won 6 more attacks, but we used 1 less with the damage. We got 0 .0, or no, 0.1% more average destruction. And um, I was participating in this war, so I'm going to show you 2 of my attacks and two other attacks in the Town Hall 10 and Town Hall 8. So, moving on to my attack, there's the Clan War map. I attacked number 32 because we tried out a new strategy in this war, which involved attacking your own number, and I'm so low because of the fact that I was working on walls for a long time. So here we go in my raid. I throw down those wall breakers in two spots to allow the golems to go right now. And I throw down my two golems in a second here just or I throw down another Barbarian here, I throw down a few more wall breakers, hoping they could break through that wall, but that level 7 Wiz Tower snipes them pretty simple. And I throw down my two Golems, and I throw down my level 5 Golem in the Clan Castle, I throw down some more wall breakers, and they just do not go. I throw down a Rage on that Golem, I put down some more wall breakers, and they just don't go. So I throw down some Wizards to combat that, take out those outside buildings, and that's exactly what they do. They take out those outside buildings with pretty much ease. And this level 5 Golem, he goes in the perfect spot here. He doesn't go into none of those apart or compartments. And as we move on here, I throw down a rage spell there. I have my wizards and my witches skeletons break that wall. And just like that, the clan castle troops are out. And I was waiting till all of them came out. And then I dropped my lightning spell on them, which worked out pretty good. But as you guys can see, the wall breaks there. I throw down my two heroes. The compartment's open. The town hall compartment's open. It's a mad rush to the town hall. Will we get there? Will we not? The Barb King's inside, he's facing the other Barb King, he can, he should win, he does in a second, there we go, now he's attacking the Town Hall, it's down, we have the 1 star, now we're going for that 2 star victory. So as our Witch, he goes on 46, 48%, and 49%, and we get the 2 star victory, which is a very nice going, but we, we maybe could get this 3 star, so as the raid progresses, I destroy some outside buildings, I have 2 of the mini golems after they died once. The Archer Queen, I have some witches, my Barb King's still alive. My Archer Queen's still on pretty good health. And they're gonna move around the base. Wizard still alive, the golem's still alive. And as we speed this up, we're at 70, 73%, 74%. We're moving around the Archer Queen, shooting some walls just like normal. And it does not look like we are gonna get that three star victory. I did run out of time. Because, but I don't think I was going to get it anyway, I'd have to beat a cannon and an archer tower and a wizard tower as well. But as you guys can see, a 2 star victory, 87%. And going into our next raid, it is another raid by myself. Way harder of a raid though. I throw down my 2 level 1 golems, throw down some wall breakers here. And this raid went picture perfect. I throw down that rage spell. Those wall breakers get through, they break through that wall. And we're almost inside to the town hall 10, or the town hall 9 compartment. So I throw down some wizards, I throw down my witches, and then my level 5 golem goes to the right place. I throw down a few more wall breakers in a second here to break through. There you go. Or excuse me, I already did throw them down. My witches are down, everything's down, it's a mad rush to the town hall. Both heroes are down, they're going to the town hall. My barb king is going. Lightning spell dropped to beat those clan castles. The rage spell dropped in the town hall. The town hall is going down, percent is going down. The barb king takes it down, we're at 1 star, 33%. And I threw down another rage spell here so they could get that two star victory, hopefully. 39%, 40%. The Archer Queen working around the outside. I still have some wizards and some witches alive, I believe. Archer Queen breaking a wall as usual. My Barb King and Golem still alive. But the rage spell does wear off in a few seconds here. But we get that two stars, and that's exactly what we needed. I let my heroes run around for a bit longer here for 44 more seconds, if you want to be exact. We're at 53%. The 3 star is not looking good. I let my Archer Queen run around for a bit more because that's the one thing that can deal any damage now. And it doesn't look like we're going to get that 3 star. So a good 2 star again on a much harder base. Number 17 in the list of bases. So going into our next raid, we see Dennis using a Drag Loon combo here against, I believe, the number 6 guy. Or number 5, I'm not quite sure. But he uses a Dragon combo, and he throws down his balloons there. Good so far. Throws down his Archer Queen and Barb King early if you didn't see that. 
with Clan Castle troops, he's not going to worry about lightning spelling those. He just lets him go. And he throws down the two rage spells. It's a mad rush. The two freeze spells are down, dropping those infernos and that air defense on the right. But the air defense on the left is still up and running. The loons take out the air defense. And can they take out the inferno? One of the loon set of loons moves away. The other takes out the other inferno. The dragons are inside. Are they going to destroy the town hall? Heroes following up on the back side. Giant bomb hits him. That doesn't do anything. But as you guys can see, the dragons go down 47%. 48% and it's not looking good but he gets that archer queen to lock onto the town hall when an archer queen is locked onto the town hall you know what's happening it's going down he gets pretty good raid here a two star victory as you guys are going to see here boom two stars for the clan a great raid by Dennis and there you go 50% two stars for the dragoon combo very nice indeed so moving on to our next raid Luke attacking a town hall 8 with the go wipe strategy so he throws down his two golems throws down some wizards to take out those outside buildings throws down his barb king not his archer queen as of yet he throws down some wall breakers to get into that middle compartment and that's exactly what they do so his golems are moving around the base to the outside he throws down another bit of wall breakers and now his archer queen is going to be dropped in a few seconds here there go the pekas and now the healing or oh, excuse me there should be a rage bell dropped in a second here by Luke, the town hall compartment is open. There's the rage bell. The Pekka's go to the outside, which is exactly what you don't want. But it actually turns out pretty good because he drops that heal spell. The wizards lock on. It's done. Forty-four percent. The two golems are on the outside. One at one, at still at big, and then there's two mini ones going around as well. The Pekka is still looking very good, and this is looking like a possible three-star victory. The Barb King getting shot at. He still has a golem in front of him, but he, there he goes down. The level 3 Pekka's running around the base. The Rage Bell still dropped in. It's looking very good for my friend Luke. And as you guys can see here, he continues around the base. All he has to do is destroy three more defenses, and he'll be done. He does destroy the three defenses, and there you go. It's just a rush for that 100%. 92%, 95, 97, 98. And there you go, 100%. Three-star victory on the best Town Hall 8 there was. Great raid by Luke. Moving on to the next one. So here, guys, it is the end. We, as you guys can see, the war stats here. We got nine three stars. They had eight. Twenty-two stars. They had twenty-one. But we had those six one stars, and they only had four new stars per attack. We had more average destruction. More. We had everything here that we needed. And Apex PvP and Jensen, most heroic attack and defense. But thank you guys for watching. This has been Crace. I'm out. I'll see you guys later. Like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz.